This is the Sports Betting Glossary. I'm Jake Higgins with the Sports Geek, and we're going to talk about the term first five betting. It's a pretty simple term, but we're going to break it down for you. Before I jump into it, though, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more sports betting content like this. So first five betting is baseball's version of a first half bet. In football or basketball, you can bet on the quarters or halves specifically, and in baseball, you can bet on how the first five innings are going to go. There is often a run line, money line, and an over-under attached to these, and they'll be pretty close to about half of whatever the total over-under is. A spread, it can be a little bit more interesting. That's Sometimes it's only half a run, sometimes it's a full run. That can vary depending on the matchup. And the money line, that can vary as well because there are baseball teams that do very well in the first half, but their bullpens can let up the lead, and so they aren't good against the spread or against the run line overall. However, in the first half, they might be because they have good starting pitching. So it's a different metric to look at, and just because someone's good at the, against the spread or against the over-under does not mean that they would in a first five scenario. So make sure you do your own analytic research for first five bets compared to a full game bet. First half bets are a good way for you to play some action on a baseball bet if you aren't confident in a bullpen but you like the starting pitcher's matchup. If you think that a starting pitcher is going to go the first five innings and they're going to be on the winning team through those first five innings but you're not confident that the bullpen can hang on to that victory, then take the first five bet. However, just know the value there isn't always the same as a full game bet, so just make sure to do your research. Let me know in the comments what your strategy is when betting first five bets. I typically stay away from them and go for full bets myself, so I'm curious to know your strategies. And as always, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more sports betting content like this. For the Sports Geek, I'm Jake Higgins. I'll see you next time.